Well, good day, people. Uh, just a while ago, I made these spoke wheels and I put them on a Scammel 1932 Scammel log truck, a plan out of Ashy's workshop series. Um, but I didn't make a trailer for it. I mean, the original Scammel log truck I made came with obviously a log trailer. And so I thought, well, let's make up a trailer for this one. Loose. I mean, there's the log, the log trailer. And here's other trailer plans that Peter Rashi uh, provides for the same truck. And I thought I'd do something modelled loosely on that. I thought I'd use a floating bogey. I like that idea, which came off the uh, log truck, or the log trailer. But I also thought I'd make up a bit of a box trailer, like this, with a lid on it that hinges and opens. I mean, kids love to be able to open the lid, put things inside and then shut the lid again. So, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to use a 3mm dowel, one of these barbecue skewers, to pivot the lid on the box. But it will need to go down towards the bottom end of the lid, near the round that I just put on, so that we get maximum clearance when the lid lifts up. So it'll go through at about here. Now I just used some of the leftover blanks from the uh, spoke wheel making here and then cut some solid 50mm uh, circles with a, a hole saw and I put the two together to make the dual wheel. But I also thought I might like to add some uh, holes around the outer wheel so I just made up a small template with paper and used that.
that's done. It worked out pretty well. I did come back afterwards and add the stands here because a lot of the time it'll be actually off a prime mover and stand alone. I mean, I'll probably use it on just about any prime mover or road tractor that I make of similar scale. But I did make the wheels different, so it looks a bit odd with this particular one. If this is the first time to my channel, please subscribe. I put out mainly woodworking videos, but occasionally I put them out on general furniture making and uh, other odds and sods around the house as well. Take care and see ya.